Hi guys, in this video I'll be talking about a diamond's hue. Hue is basically the shade of color a diamond can have. For example, here is a hue chart. Diamonds can come in fancy colors such as fancy pink, fancy blue, fancy red, and many other fancy colors. But did you know that white diamonds can have other hues as well? What I mean is, white diamonds uh, such as those with color grades D, E, F, G can have different hue colors associated with them. One common term to describe this is BGM, which is the acronym of brownish, greenish, or milky. And in this video, I'll be focusing on brownish stones. Now this is a tone chart. Basically, the tone is how light or dark the diamond appears. For white diamonds, a lighter tone is more desirable as it will look more colorless. Whereas for fancy colored diamonds, a medium to darker tone is preferred uh, as it can highlight the intensity of its color. Okay, I'm going to show you some small mini diamonds as examples to show you guys. First up is a diamond with a brownish hue. So as you can see on the hue chart on the left, the diamond is brownish. On the tone chart on the right, this diamond is considered to have a very light tone. Next up is a diamond with a yellowish hue. It has a very light tone as well. I'll be keeping the tone of all these diamonds consistent so there won't be any external factors that can visually affect its hue. And lastly, this is a white diamond with no hue and a very light tone. Okay, so when you see these three diamonds uh, together, the left one which is the brownish hue, the middle with the yellowish hue, and the right one with no hue. Now if you think there's not much difference in these three diamonds, let me show you something. When I pile them up like this, can you see the brownish hue in them? And these are the diamonds with the yellowish hue. And the diamonds with no hue. If you look at these three piles of diamonds, there is clearly a big difference. Now this is related to the brownish aspect in a BGM diamond. A white diamond can also have a greenish hue. It can even appear milky. Though a milky diamond is more related to a diamond's inclusion and not its hue. Now it's very important to note that a diamond suffering from these BGM effects will not be shown on its certificate. That's also why BGM diamonds are always traded at steep discounts and a lot of consumers are unaware of this. So it's important for your trusted jeweler to look out for this and uh, this is also one of the many factors that we take into account for all of our diamonds. We ensure that each and every stone from the largest carat to the smallest milli diamond do not have these BGM effects. So there you go. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Do like this video if you find it helpful. Thank you.